if you harvest, let's say 2,000 large larvae, you want to keep back 200 of those to pupate and turn into beetles to keep your colony going. If you want to grow your colony, you're going to keep more of that. And then whatever you've got that you are going to allocate for use for small mammals, your reptiles, chickens, whatever, if you want to stretch that out, you can take those larvae and put them in the fridge. A regular human fridge is perfectly fine. It gets to you know 40 to 45 is the general range for those. Uh, make sure you don't put them in a cold spot, right? So that spot in the back of the fridge where you know things freeze, uh, don't put them there. Uh, but they they will do fine in 40 to 45 degree temperature. Uh, once you get below that they're going to really start to slow down they'll struggle to move and that's where they like they'll struggle to be able to get oxygen uh, they live in things like grain silos which are dense densely packed sometimes don't have good airflow and so they don't need a lot of oxygen there's actually an interesting study i read when i was looking at the carbon dioxide output from them um, they do better in lower oxygen environments 